So, yes. Hi family, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back everyone. Today I'm going to be sharing with you all the items that I picked out from my last vlog. So if you haven't seen that vlog yet, I'm going to put it up right here or rather still in the description box down below. So go ahead, help yourself, check out that vlog and see all the beautiful things that are out for this season. And if this is the first time that you're stumbling on this channel and you don't know what this channel is all about, my name is Chi Chi and I concentrate on fashion and pretty much every other thing. If it sounds like what you're interested in, so go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Become part of this little family. Let's grow together. And to my returning subscribers, you guys know that I love you. Thank you all for coming back. So like I said today, I'm just gonna share with you all the little things that I got from the mini vlog. And I'm not gonna waste any of y'all's time. So let's just get right into it. So I'm gonna start with the first item. And the first item I'm gonna share with you all is from Chanel and it's from the beauty section. Um, let me get that back. So this is how it comes. It comes with this beautiful white and um, black bag. This is the bag right here. I already unboxed this cause I couldn't wait, okay? <laughs> so this is, excuse me. This is the item that I got. Like I said, it's from the beauty section and it's, um, it's an eye patch. I do have like baggy eyes and um, I have something that I've been using from Amazon. I'm also gonna put it down in the description box. It's very good, but I've heard good things about this and I really, really wanted to try it out. So several times I've tried to get it from the website. It's always saying sold out. So I walked into the Chanel store and they had it in there. So I was just like, okay, I might as well just get it while I'm there. Um, it does come in this beautiful box right here and you just open it up and what's inside, oops, sorry. Once you open it up, these are the eye patches right here. So there are 10 in number. This is the serum that you apply under your, um, before you go ahead and put this on your eyes. So I do want to try this out and see what the the hype is all about and I can't wait to share with you all how it turns out to be because like I said I've, I have serious eye bags and another good thing is you can reuse each pack so you can use it save it and use it back again so that's the reason why I got it it's quite a little bit pricey but yeah I can reuse this patches um, twice or three times before I use the next one so I feel like it's really, really great for the price. And um, yeah, I wanna see what this rave is all about. The one that I got from Amazon, it's a one-time use. So when you put it on your eyes, um, you have to discard it after like 10 to 15 minutes. It comes like I think 20 to 30 in a pack. It's really, really good. You have to put it in the fridge to make it a little bit cool before you put it under your eyes. For these, I haven't read the directions on how to use it or if I have to put this in the fridge as well to make it cool, I don't know. But I'm willing to, like I said, I'm willing to try it out and see the outcome and see if like my eye bags really, really go down. So yeah, I'm going to update you guys on this. And yeah, so this is the first item. And my wonderful essay was kind enough to give me a whole bunch of goodies in here. Like I said, I already, unraveled everything but it's a whole bunch of goodies in here and like samples and all that so yeah um i can't wait to try this i'll let y'all know how it works so the next item i got is a pair of accessory from chanel now i didn't go to chanel to get accessory i went to get this beauty product the ipad but somehow somehow i managed to come out with this accessory okay it's a sunglass so hold on it's in here I already unraveled it already because like I said I unboxed everything this is how it comes in this is the box this is the item right here obviously it's a sunglass that I got I know I just bought one 
what, three months ago, but I could not resist this, especially when I'd seen it on my Instagram crush, Amrezy. Ha! Huh. I was like, oh my god, I need to get this, because, I mean, they're probably going to look good on me. Probably, or they look good on me. It has this nice quilted um, details right here, also at the side and right here. So go ahead and open it up. It's also like a, a velvet material, and there you can see the Chanel written over there and like i said i already unboxed this this is and this is the side with the cc logo on the side look at that details right here it does say chanel on top of the um rims right here so this is pretty cool and let me just put this on my eyes we're going to see Voila. This is so cute. This is this is this is dope. Okay. It gives me that cut eye kind of vibe. And I am so loving this. Um, this is another great piece in my closet and you know stacking up all that great accessories, you know, to style with my clothing. It's beautiful, it's great. It's great for summer, it's great for everything that you pretty much want to wear, so except dressy dressy outfits, but like yeah, this is a great glass and it was great price as well, so love it. Alright, so the next item I'm going to share with you is from the Gucci store and um, it's an accessory. Let me get that for you all. And so it comes in this Gucci box right here. And um, let's open it right here. Comes in a dust bag. Ta da! This is the baseball hat. And I do love this. Like, look at this, guys. Look, look at this. Take a look at this. This is so beautiful. It goes with my my top this is really nice I'm not really pressing it all the way down because I don't want to smirch my makeup this is um, I believe a size large let me see um, yes this is a size large uh, yeah I got a size large I was actually going for a size small and the S it told me no way I'll be able to wear a size small especially when you have like weaves on or you have hair on you know you can't wear a size small i already put some makeup in here but that's okay it does have this velcro right here that you can adjust just to make it a little bit big or tighter so you can adjust it right here and i love the embossed logo on it and also the leather trimmings right here you can see at the size I just love this baseball hat and like I said I was just looking for um, a baseball hat that could go with literally everything in my closet make it casual make it dressy and it doesn't really um, select like the kind of clothes that you wear like this is brown and light light brown and dark brown so you can go with anything that I wear like so like this I know it's print on print right now but like I think this is a little bit settled and this is embossed so I literally could get away with pairing this together but overall I love the hat this is a uh, 58 centimeters which I said it's a large so if you're looking to get into this sorry I'm sniffing cuz kind of got like a little bit of cold okay and corona but it's cold <laughs> okay um so if you're looking to get into getting this hat make sure you get like a large or even an extra large because I wish I went for an extra large but this this is fine this is this is perfect this would work because like I said it has this velcro at the back for adjust this is gonna be my closet for a very long time like I said I can dress it up I can dress it down and that's the great part of this I just couldn't get off of it and I feel like for the price, it's great investment in your closet. And yeah, this is wonderful. Love it. All right, so now to the last item, which is uh, the best. <laughs> yes, 
in here in this box right here. I don't even want to talk too much. Let's just open the box. All right. So I already unboxed it as well. I did an unboxing for my TikTok. So if y'all not following me on TikTok, my TikTok handle is Chikamasta. Yes, I'm there, but the sister don't really know what she's doing over there. But I'm getting a hang of it. So check me out at Chikamasta on TikTok. And I'll put it right here so you guys can also see it. So I did an unboxing for my TikTok and I'm also going to be posting that on my Instagram reels as well. So this is the bag right here. I already unboxed it, but we're just pretending that we're unboxing it in the camera. So here is the bag inside the box and let's take it out. Here is it in the dust bag. This is the bag, okay? Let me put the box down because we need to talk about this bag, okay? All right. This, can we just appreciate this bag? Look at this bag right now. Look at the gorgeousness right now. Like, tell me this bag is not beautiful. It is beautiful. She is beautiful. Uh, what am I gonna give her? Melinda? No. Stacy, <laughs> no. Well, y'all should let me know what I should call this bag, okay? This was on my 2021 luxury wish list, and I finally got my hands on this bag. Like, guys, you don't even understand how I was trying to hunt this bag down. At the time that I had it on my wish list, they did not have it on the website. They had only one in the store, and that was the only one I saw. And it was for somebody, it was for a customer. And the person was actually gonna pick it up. So I'm like, whoa, does that mean I'm not gonna get my hands on this bag? Because I said that time that was the only one left. And I was like, okay, um, I'm gonna start looking for like um, a backup for like this because I really wanted a bag that had the bamboo hand from Gucci with the classic monogram um, prints. And uh, I stumbled on this one right here, and I felt like, oh, this would be a great alternative to this. Even though the the Gigi is like the embossed Gigi, but I I didn't mind. Like I was like, I'll probably just take that because it's like it mimics this kind of like a little bit. But then I was like, okay, um, I know I want it, but but I wasn't really really pressed to have it. And my eyes were still on this. I was to contact my essay. Do they have it? And he's like, no. And then all of a sudden, one day, he's like, we got your bag in. If you're still interested, you can pay and you can come pick it up. I'm like, swipe me away. Mm. I want it. Shop, shop. Yeah, woo. So I paid and I went in to pick this baby up. It does say Gucci right there, and it has um, the silver hardware right here. Um, again, the top handle is made of bamboo, and the connectors are right like in silver hardwares. I do love the silver um, stubs right here, all over the bag and underneath the bag now underneath the bag right here underneath the bag right here you can see that it does have the GG all lined up in um, the way they are supposed to be lined up and then turning the back to the bag you can also see the silver hardware right here and the beautiful canvas at the back so now we're gonna go to the front and open this bag to open this bag you just push it down like so and it opens and this is the interior like look at this bag look at the interior I love the mixture of the red fabric inside of this this is not like a vel velvet material it's like a, a regular um, fabric material but I just love the color contrast red inside of it with the mixture of the dark brown here and inside just has tissue right 
here and I'm gonna take it off. And inside you do have a strap right here, which I'm going to take out. This is the strap, so if you want to do this, put this as a crossbody on your, um, if you wanna carry this as a crossbody, you do have a strap right here. And it also comes with like the booklet and the key. So if you wanna lock this back, If you want to lock this bag, you can go ahead and lock it. But I'm not locking it. I have bags that like have locks and I don't even use it. So I'm not going to use it. But you do have the options. You do have the option to use the lock. I mean the key to lock the bag. And um, yeah. Also in here you do have the Gucci um you do have the Gucci right there inside here it's pretty much a kind of like a structured bag so to put stuff inside this bag wouldn't be so hard to put in the bag because I can just throw things in and still pretty much organize them in this bag because of the way the bag is constructed it looks like um, a square shaped bag if I'm not mistaken this is not a rectangular bag it's a square shaped bag this is called um, the Gigi Trotter um, suitcase um, bag this is from the I think it's from the 2018 like the runway show when they had like the the trunk show the trunk case show so this is from the 2018 runway show and it's still in production and I'm so glad like I said so glad that I got my hands on this because y'all don't y'all don't understand I've been hunting this so I have crossed out the Gigi Trouble bag from my 2021 luxury wish list and I'm closing down on that luxury wish list because pretty much everything there it's almost um done basically have almost everything. This year, I'm not sure if I'm going to do a 2022 luxury wish list because I know what I want already this year. So any other thing I add on um, this year is just added on, but I know the major items that I really, really want for this year. And if I can get my hands on it, it's not a, it's not a big deal. I'll just wait. I'm learning how to be very patient waiting for the items that I really really do love and I feel like I'm going to be classics in my closet so I'm going for classic looks rather than like trendy looks I do have some trendy purses and I intend to keep those I recently got rid of three bags and that's because like they were just gathering dust in my closet and I felt like I was forced to pick up those bags and just use them so I'm like okay they're sitting down there I rarely use them so why don't I just sell them and get what I really want so now I am curating a classic um, wall collection back collection if I should say and also keeping my little trendy purses in different colors so this is classic to me it's been in production like I said since 2018 and you're still producing it it does come in black as well and oh I'm going to put this handle for you guys to see so so the way this is done is it goes in one direction so you need to be able to put the bag in the direction that it goes so that it doesn't flap when you put it on so I put this um, the first um, hook right here and then I'm going to go ahead and put the second hook over here still facing the direction that it's supposed to be facing but I'm going to show you guys a full look in a minute because uh, I know you guys are not seeing what I'm showing you all so let's get into the styling of this bag. That's all I have today to share with you all. Thank you guys for sticking to the end of this video. If you did love this video, give it a thumbs up. Also hit the like button. Turn on your notification bell 
so y'all can get notified anytime I post any new content right here on my channel. And with that being said, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Take care and remain safe. Bye-bye.